In this feature video, we're going to take a look at the unused Q store in the QuickQ software. This is available from QuickQ version 9 onwards. So in our QuickQ software available both on the designer software and consoles, under the menu, you now have an unused stacks window. Here you have unused Q stacks. These can be single queues, they could be chases or Q stacks. And you can drag and drop from this window onto your playbacks, the left hand faders or the execute window. So I can now take a playback here. So I've got, uh, maybe it's a song that I'm using in, in a church environment. And I could take and drag that onto one of my playbacks. I can then run that. And while I'm using that, I could take another Q stack and I can drag that down. Okay, I've got one here, uh, spots blue. And I'm gonna drag that here onto playback uh, number eight. I can run that. And then when I finish with a playback, I can just simply drag and drop it back into the Q store. You can of course name these so you know uh, what your chases, stacks, or cues are doing in here. Uh, they can be whole cue lists, so maybe it's a particular song, uh, and you will just want to drag and drop it, uh, giving you more flexibility within your show. Your left-hand faders on a quick cue console support single cue only, so if you have single cue stacks, and you can see that number of cues shown below here, the title of a cue stack shown above, you can drag and drop these onto the playbacks as well, and you can take them off the playbacks as well. To do that on a physical console, you say action, click the button below the fader, move, and then click in the window, we'll drop it back inside the window again. And you can do the same action to put it back uh, onto a playback or fader on that left-hand side as well. We can do the same with the execute window, so I can say action, click on an item, and I can move it into my execute window in exactly the same way. So this provides a major new way of giving you more playbacks and more control on your QuickQ console, available in version 9 onwards.